Wake of the shooting, police and the university present promised to boost security on campus. This comes as a petition has growing support to limit access to the public and also to address safety concerns that have been around for years. Tonight, the president cautioned against the closed campus solution. I always knew it could happen anywhere. Security is important. There should be more security. We are an open campus. With the help of our regional partners, we are going to increase the level of uh, staffing. Friday, UNLV Police Chief Garcia pledged more law enforcement visibility and patrols, all in response to growing calls for more campus security. Garcia and President we Keith Whitfield say a review of current safety of, practices uh, has already begun, but did not elaborate on what other measures could be forthcoming. There is a groundswell to support limiting access to the open urban campus. In a change.org petition with signatures creeping close to 15,000 people, it suggests broad requirements for ID verification. Building entrances will require anyone who wants to enter to provide some form of a verification to access. Others want radical change. UNLV should not be an open campus. I am a student at UNLV and I believe that it should be a closed campus only for students and teachers. There are many homeless people that hang out in the student union. Fox 5 has covered safety concerns around UNLV for years. Students worry about pedestrian robberies at night and encounters with the homeless and mentally ill. In fall of 2022, following a string of stabbings in surrounding neighborhoods and the death of Officer Trung Tai, Metro Police and then Sheriff Lombardo pledged more patrols for an area they called a hotspot for crime. They believe that if somehow we, we cordoned off or we made gates around all of ours that we would make ourselves perfectly safe. And we know from other urban universities that's just not true. President Whitfield voiced support for added law enforcement, cautioning against fortifying campus. In a November letter addressing protests by some off-campus organizers, he wrote, students should report threats and discrimination, but as a public university, every individual has a right to visit our campus. Is just one of those situations that we are struggling with as a country. It's part of our safety is, is being a community. And Chief Garcia says the review of campus safety will take months.